everyone, so this is a bonus video because I just uploaded and I also just got my Ipsy bag in the mail so I figured I would put up a quick video showing you guys what I got inside. So in case if you're not familiar, Ipsy is a monthly subscription service so you pay $10 a month and they send you a bag with products in it. The products range from um, full size to travel size to sample size to higher end products, organic, natural products, and then also drugstore products. So you get a little bit of everything with these bags. You go online and you take a quiz and they try to put products in your bag based on what you picked for the answers. So it also came with a card and it says Ipsy Prep Bag. This is their back to school bag. And on the back it just has directions on how to enter a contest. So you also get a bag every month which is nice because uh, you can use it if you're traveling and stuff like that. But if you get this every month you're just going to have a lot of bags lying around. So let me see what I got in here. So the first product that I see is a double Lux Doubler by Scone Cosmetics and this is an eye and lip pencil in wine so this is a full size product and um, once I show you guys what this is I'm going to open them up and do swatches. Then I got another full size pencil product and this is Pencil Me Natural Formula Eye Accent Pencil in Boysenberry. So this it's hard to tell what color it is without opening it. Um, it almost looks like a purple or a blue color and it also has a sharpener on it so I wonder if the sharpener is any good and if it is that is awesome. Here I have a high carry probably not saying that right. Um, this is a lip gloss in the shade, shade Salsa and this looks pinkish but also orange so I guess it's like a coral color so I'll have to see like what that swatch is out to be. And then next I got a travel size product and this is by Beauty Without Cruelty. This is their leave-in conditioner. It's 100% vegan vegetarian. So this is supposed to be good for all hair types and it has no synthetic fragrance to it. It definitely smells like a natural product but in a good way it has like a nice refreshing scent to it. And then the last thing I got is this Eco Beauty by LA Fresh Group Goodnight Cream Super Hydration Smoother and Plumper Looking Skin and this is a sample size and this is a natural anti-aging botanicals and this is half an ounce and I love this because I hate when they give you packages that you just rip open and there's enough product for obviously more than one use and you kind of have to throw it away because it dries out so I really like that this has like a lid on it so you can hopefully reuse so on the back it says, bye bye damaging elements that age my skin every minute. Hello recovered, recharged, youthful looking me. This highly natural LA Fresh Eco Beauty Good Night Night Cream provides super hydration and restores a visibly smoother and plumper skin appearance. Reduces you from fine wrinkles on the forehead and crow's feet. Made with collagen producing peptides, super hydrating hyaluronic acid, natural shea butter, aloe, antioxidant, penethanol, Frolic acid, vitamin E, and anti aging botanical complex, including murky berry, licorice root, grapeseed, and hickory bark. So, yeah, this is highly natural, biodegradable formula, cruelty free, and California born. And for directions, it just says apply it generously to a clean face and neck after using their face serum. And it also recommends using Eco Beauty skincare products, exercising modestly. Drinking plenty of water, eating healthy meals, sleeping enough hours, hugging more often, and smiling more. So I'm really excited to try out this eye cream because my skin is hella dry. So let me go ahead and open these up and do swatches for you so you can see what these products look like. Okay, so this boysenberry pencil me looks like it's going to be a nice blue color. And it is. It's like a navy, almost plum blue. It definitely reminds me of like a deep blueberry color. It's very smooth and pigmented. Like you barely need to touch this to your skin to get it to come off. And it also comes with a sharpener on the cap, which is pretty cool. So I really like this pencil. It seems like it will smudge out like a dream. So here I have the um, eye slash lip liner, and this is in wine. And then again, you barely need to press down on this to get it to show up, and it is like a gorgeous deep dark purple wine color, and this would look really nice on the eyes and the lips, so that is exciting. And then I'm going to swatch this lip gloss for you. 
So this looks like it's pretty pigmented as well. And in case if you're wondering, like, if you see, like, weird stuff on my hands, I have henna that's, like, on its last leg, barely there. So this is definitely more red looking than what it looks in the tube, at least in my opinion. So it's pretty opaque gloss, and it doesn't really seem to have a scent to it. Actually, it kind of has like a weird, like plasticky, like gross, not like super gross, but like kind of gross scent to it. Um, hopefully it wouldn't be too noticeable on the lip, so it does have a nice shine to it. So yeah, that's what these products swatch look like. So that is it for my Ipsy bag. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe so you're notified when new videos come out, and I'll see you next time. Bye!